I've already prepped my skin with moisturiser. Now I'm just taking a pump of my foundation. And I just like to dot it onto my skin, especially on the areas I need it. So my redness areas, which are down here, and then I take some down my nose, and then I take some over my chin, just like that. And I just use my clean hands just to work this in. I have been loving this foundation recently. It blends so easily. I probably should be looking in the mirror for this instead of the viewfinder. Um, it blends so easily into the skin. And it does look a bit red now, but when my skin calms down in a minute, you'll be able to see that it just hides all the redness, which is so important to me. Um, so I'm just working this in with my fingers. And then I'm just going to check in the mirror that it's all blended in, because it probably isn't, because I'm just using a viewfinder. So, mirror time. So as you can see now, I look very, very pale, so I definitely need to add some blush. The blush I've been loving is a na this Natural Collection one in Pink Cloud. So I just get a blush brush and literally just put some of this on my cheeks. Now the reason I look so weird and pale is because I normally am so red that when I just put foundation on, my skin looks like incredibly sort of normal and pale which is why I have to put quite a lot of blush on to kind of compensate for the paleness so I'm just sort of working this back and I do put like I said I do put quite a lot on I'm then going to powder my skin like I do normally. This is my awkward, I'm grabbing something face. So I just like to get some powder into the lid, just like that. And then just get this and adjust work it into the skin. And I'm sorry if me looking into the viewfinder puts you off and I'm not looking at the camera but kind of need to see what I'm doing. So I just sort of work it all over the skin. Now I don't always conceal under my eyes just because the foundation does such a good job. I do just tend to leave it and I do also go over the blush just so it blends into the skin a bit. just like that so that's pretty much my foundation routine when I wear foundation Um, I don't tend to wear foundation every single day but on the days where I want to look sort of more perfected and less red <laughs> which is very important for me Um, this is the foundation I've been using and I've been loving it and yeah so I'll just do a close-up of my skin I'll see how I can zoom in So you can, as you can see, you can still see my freckles through, which is really important for me because I don't want to hide them. But it is very flawless and it, uh, it does match in with my skin perfectly. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you all again soon. Bye. Chill. It's relaxing. It's cool. I always feel like I do such weird movements and then one of the thumbnails is just like me like... Anyway, um...